Welcome to week two of Dark Dragon Month. It's October, Halloween month, all the spirits and, and the ghosts and ghoulies are on the go. So, okay, let's talk about dark attribute dragons because they are so strong. There's so many things you can do with them. So this week it is caught the Omni Dragon Brotar. Now when you look at him, he actually looks like a baby version of last week's dragon, the Chaos Ruler. Dragon of Mag you know, Chaotic Magical Dragon. And yes, he has the same kind of head. He has the same kind of wings. And this time he is, well, he's casting blue magic. At least that's what it looks like. Because the, uh, the last dragon, he was going on with the red. The red magic, you know, the ruby magic, whatever they call. So it looks like Omni Dragon Brotar is the baby and the Chaos Ruler is the big daddy, which is, makes sense. Because like the Chaos, uh, the Blue Eyes Chaos Dragon, we got the big daddy and we got baby. So yeah, I guess Konami just want to make some big dragons and baby dragons. But Omni Dragon Brotar, oh man, like he is really good. He's just a level one dragon. But uh, if a monster you control is destroyed by a battle or your opponent's card effect, if this guy's in your hand or in your grave, you can just get this guy out. And you can use him, now he'll be banished if he leaves the field. Now, if this card is special summoned in any way, so I'm guessing it includes, you know, from your hand or from the grave, you can take out one piece of monster on the field, discard one card, and if you do, add one monster from your deck to your hand with the same type and attribute as that target but a different name. So yes, when it comes to Dragon Lynx, this guy, <laughs> one of the most common cards you see because he is a dark, he is a dragon, and with Dragon Lynx, they're all light or dark dragons. At least most of them are. So not only is he a free special summon depending on the condition, but even if it's in your grave and he's special summoned or you can use one for one because he's a level one, easy to get out, you can use him to search your deck for another dragon that you may need to extend your plays. So, <laughs> yeah. So, depending on the situation, there are multiple uses for Omni Dragon Brotar, and he was crazy. Now, did I use him all the time? Mm, not really. I did use him once in my Dragon Link deck in the OTS. Um, if you search my deck profiles, you'll definitely find Dragon Links and you'll see him being included. Like, he's just that good. So, yep. Now, if I use him again, well, again, it really depends. I'm not the biggest meta deck player. I just splash around from time to time because when it comes to engines, I prefer to use the Blue Eyes engine in combination. It's just, just, I just like it so much. So, what do you think? Do any, any of you still use Omni Dragon Brotar? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, remember to be a good sport, play the game, not the fame, and stay tuned for week three of Dark Dragon Month.